Hi, Jason Schick here at CPI Training Center. Uh, talk a little bit about uh, medical gas systems and how that affects our lives uh, without us even knowing it, uh, very much like a lot of the plumbing systems that we've talked about in the past. So a medical gas system basically is going to appear in most, in all hospitals. Uh, it's going to appear in dentist office, outpatient uh, places, and, and this area here, the Cleveland area, you can see the, the expansion of that in the different hospitals moving out to the surrounding suburbs. Um, so medical gases play a key component in keeping everybody healthy and safe. So the plumber, most people don't know, installs these medical gases. So if you need to have that anesthesia, those gases, uh, pipes that bring that uh, system to the anesthesiast to put you to sleep, or a family member is actually installed by a plumber. Um, all the uh, nitrogen lines, oxygen lines, anything that has to do with uh, operating. So if you're sitting in a dentist chair, you get your teeth drilled, or they're using the uh, the brushes to clean your teeth and, and water jets and things like that, all that is considered medical gases and it is also then created uh, and installed by the plumbers. Um, there is a certification you go through that we'll talk about a little bit more, but this is a kind of a classic setup, but almost like an ICU room in a hospital wing. So as you come out of surgery, you would have the surgery room with the medical gases and in a lot of these areas here you have the wall out that's everything is uh, specific to that particular gas so there could be no cross connection of gases if they put an oxygen mask on you that you're sure you're getting oxygen and that's instead of nitrogen which then would become disastrous uh, back in the 1970s there was a lot of uh, fatalities throughout the, the united states and here even here in the greater cleveland area and now the codes and standards are, are strengthened up enough you double triple check everything before they're actually turned over to the patient to, in order to keep the, the patient with a healthy uh, outcome for whatever procedure they're dealing with. If you have any questions or if you have any issues with your medical gas,